Welcome to the channel. Let's see how to become an absolute ninja online with proxy for you and go log in. All right. If you are looking for the ultimate proxy experience and how to use it in an efficient way, I'm going to show you proxy for you and another tool you can use in conjunction with it to become an online ninja. Yes, you will master ninjutsu. Also, this you will become untraceable and become very, very efficient if you are trying to make money online. Now, why would you use a proxy? I'm going to get into that. Maybe the difference between that and a VPN and then show you this awesome tool that you can use in conjunction with it. So get ready to be an absolute beast. I know you are already, but let's dive into the world of proxies. Now, you might just say, why don't I use a VPN? Well, VPN is useful for browsing the internet, meaning you can go ahead and change your country from one country to another. I'm in the US. I can say I'm in the UK, Canada, or Switzerland, or a tropical island, which I'd like to be. Um, not with a proxy, but sitting on the beach would be nice. But that has limitations. What are the limitations? If I'm trying to do multiple things, like let's say I have multiple Facebook accounts and I want to try and sell a marketplace. Facebook doesn't like when you have multiple accounts or I have multiple LinkedIn accounts and I got blocked. Or I have multiple this account or that account. They're generally not going to like that. So something like Upwork or Fiverr, especially if you're using lots of data or transferring data or scraping, things like that are going to be very difficult with a VPN and just a standalone VPN that you get like out of Opera or something like that. You're going to want to get proxies. That's what you want to do to make money online, to do it safely, and to be, like I said, to be a ninja. Now, there's so many proxies out there. You might just say, well, why don't I just get, you know, proxy off the internet or something like that? And you can, but quality will be diminished. And it might not serve your purposes. Upwork might still ban you. Facebook might still ban you. You still might be, you know, in a tough spot. You really want to go professional, but it doesn't have to break the bank. There are different types of proxies, so let's get into that. You can do residential. That's going to be a physical computer like this one. I got a laptop here or a desktop, you know, depending on your preference, but it's going to be a computer or a, you know, desk that's actual a physical one there. And these are usually pretty good. Then they'll have data centers. The only problem with a data center is they sometimes can detect you, but they are very good for using different data centers in case you need that. Then there's mobile proxies, and that is self-explanatory. That's a proxy that's going to be a mobile phone. And the best part is you can start for free, and when you decide to jump in, which you will, especially when you're expanding your online team, your base, and doing different stuff. Maybe you're, you know, working multiple YouTube crypto channels. Hey, I need a way around this. I need some residential proxies. You don't have to break the bank. You don't have to put in hundreds of thousands of dollars. You can literally pay as you go. Pay as you go with whether you want to do residential, whether you want to rock it in a data center. And we have tons of locations. As you'll see, I have residential proxies that I use. So it can be used if you're traveling. Maybe you're traveling and you want to, you know, do some work while you got your lab. Also, sellers love this. This is extremely intuitive. You can track your competitors. You can understand customers. All an analysts love this as well. You can scale at ease. And you can also take a look at different trends. SaaS brands are like, bro, this is awesome. Business owners love it as well. So whether you're doing internet marketing, whether you're a data analyst, whether you're getting leads, whether you're a business owner, whether you're an agency, e-com professionals, you know, you got 17 Facebook marketplaces going. That's really cool. Or you're just traveling. It's going to be efficient. And you can start for a free trial. So first thing I would do is go ahead and get started now. Click on get started now. Boom. You're on your way to becoming an internet ninja and a beast and being completely safe. Also, one thing to mention is you get 24 seven support. Any time of day, any place, you get the support that you need. You can test with one gigabyte and you get privacy guaranteed and ethical IPs. This one's huge because there's a lot of proxy extensions you could get and they're not gonna be all that great. You know, you don't even know if the IPs are legit, if they're residential is legit or they're mobile or their data centers are legit. And you get sticky sessions so the IP trace changes. So they're not gonna find you. So I'd enter your name, email, password, company, how to contact you, use for, and click register. So that is the first step. Then after we got all that down, and I know you got it down because we're beasts here, then I'm gonna show you inside proxy for you get excited okay so we're in here first thing I would do if you do not see a plan on the left hand side you can come to residential data or mobile and you just want to click buy now get the price you want and confirm order you can see here 
some of the good things are the mobile proxies, 100% uptime, 24-7 support on all of them. The data center proxies are basically 100% uptime as well. Residential, you know, 5 million ethically sourced IPs, 24-7. It's good to go. Free country targeting. Uh, paper traffic. You're going to be an absolute beast. Let's be honest. So we can come here and pick a country that we want. I'm feeling French today. Um, not because of the proxies, you know, I just had some good French bread. So I'm going to get France and then I can go ahead and play with the configuration here. Now you can also see the usage here. There's custom settings. I wouldn't worry too much about that. You can change the default targeting. You can also exclude countries if you don't want certain countries. Um, and then you can change it from rotating to sticky. It means it's going to change. And then I just go ahead and keep the protocol the same and hit save configuration. So now I have uh, some French bread and some French proxies. But how do we utilize this proxy? Well, he's stuck with me for six minutes, so I am going to show you the cool thing that you can use in conjunction with this. All right, so this is go login. No, that's not me telling you to go login, although we will. Um, <laughs> this is a way to browse your Facebook, your Google. You want to have 50 Google accounts. You want to do LinkedIn, you know, message a million people a day, uh, eBay, Amazon, and let's face it, you get banned on one of these platforms, you know, it's bad news bears, but you get proxy for you and you align it with go login. They're not there. You can have, you know, as many profiles as you want, have 50 Facebook profiles, bro. You're going to be a happy boy. So no bans or suspicious logins on any site. That's the big thing. Um, access from any location. So you have 20 Facebook accounts. Facebook doesn't like that. Sorry, Zuckerberg, but we're going to use that. And you can share accounts with any team member. So you have uh, VA. You can do that. You can set this all up and just give this to them. And they can do it. They also have 24-7 real-time support. Organize accounts, all that stuff. So what I would do, if you want to do it, is a seven-day trial. Or you can simply just go ahead, sign in, log in. And you can also download it for Windows. All right, so in Go Login, we have multiple profiles right here. You can change them here, and you can even set them for specific things like Facebook for the UK. We can go ahead and run these, um, and that will pop up browsers. But to do to set this up, we want to click on Add Profile. Then I have the country France right here. And then I have multiple things here. You can change time zone, RTC. It will actually have your profile right here. So you go to your proxy, then you're going to see all this information. You're like, wait, this is complicated, right? Not really. Here's the good thing. Go uh, proxy for you makes it really, really simple. So then all you have to do is copy and paste from go login. So simplifying it out here, you can do it one of two ways. You can copy the information from here, the proxy format, or copy it all in one go. I think it's easier to do this. You just come here, residential, and you have all the information here. So you can copy the port, copy, port, and you have the IP address or host. So you got the port, IP address or host, password. That might seem complicated, but it's not. You just paste that here. And then login, copy and paste here. And then we have it set to HTTP, and then we have the amount of traffic here, all that kind of stuff. And that's really actually all you need to do. You also want to make sure that you have the right operating system for you. You're going to want to change the operating system based on what you have on Windows 10. So we'll do that, and then you can go ahead and check it. So that's all you have to do. Go ahead, copy all the information over. That's what. That's how I would... Uh, do it. I would first start at proxy for you and then go to go login, copy the information, make sure it's all good for your proxy, make sure that your operating system is legit. Then the time zone will be based on the external IP. Um, I don't add any extensions or anything like that. And then you're pretty much good to go and you can check your proxy. So now I've got my proxy rolling. I got Google. So I just go ahead and run this bad boy. And here it's going to be a little bit uh, you know, so so you can see Facebook ads, all this stuff right here. And I can say, what is my IP address? And I may have to do a capture here. We can see here I am in France. We can actually see the profiles here. This is profile one and you can run multiple profiles just like that. Very, very cool. 
So let me know what you think of it. That is the tutorial in a nutshell. You can become an absolute online ninja and beast. And you can see now how this can help run multiple businesses. So get away from those bands and get to rolling on that next project. If you enjoyed this video, found it informative, smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell to know when I post more videos. Questions or comments, let me know down below. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.